I'm pleased to see that the ranks are pretty full. I'd like to thank all the present members who have taken this opportunity to discuss in our circle complexity. Um, this uh, plenary session, which is held every second year, um, is, I think, one of the uh, major activities of our academy. And uh, we uh, have the opportunity and the chance to bring in uh, scientific aspects with effects on our daily life of each of us and of the whole uh, human population, and furthermore, on the environment, which, are, which is our habitat and the habitats of many other living beings. So uh, I attach much importance to your help to really discuss advances in the scientific knowledge and reflections on what that can mean for long periods of time of future development. Um, we have the possibility to invite non-members to our debates, and we uh, feel that we shouldn't use this possibility too much because a debate in a smaller circle is always easier than in a large assembly. However, we have the chance uh, to have among us uh, one scientist who also will uh, present her view on systems biology. Uh, this is Lilia Albergina. We, uh, I became fam familiar with her some time ago in, and we talked on systems biology and we felt mutually, in fact, her uh, co contribution of her work to our debate on complexity might be very fruitful. So thank you to have come and we look forward to uh, your presentation. Um, since the last, in the last two years, we lost a few of our members, unfortunately, and the council has decided to make that commemoration in the closed session on Tuesday evening. Um, and so the presentation of new members. We have uh, two new members, which are uh, Joachim von Braun on the one hand, from Germany, and Wanderlei Pagnato from Brazil. So welcome in our circle. And the self-presentation will also be, uh, we have decided so yesterday, on the end of our meeting. But we have the occasion to talk with these new members during the two days already. Um, in the closed session in Tuesday late afternoon, besides these uh, presentations and the commemoration, we uh, intend to inform you, first of all, on the activities which are being planned. Uh, we will talk a little bit on the publication of our activities and spreading the information also to the Curia. And we will uh, invite you to reflect on renewing our membership. It is clear that each of us um, will become older from year to year, and we would need a little bit more young uh, blood <coughs> in order to secure a long-term uh, sustainability of our academy. <laughs> yes, and the other thing is we will also uh, have a uh, commemoration of the Pius 11 medal. Um, 
and we uh, invite also the members, usually on the closed session, to make uh, nominations for possible new uh, candidates for, for that. So, uh, if you, from your point of view, have uh, ideas which you want also to discuss in the closed session, closed session means all the members, of course, are important to be present, all those who can, and, uh, but non-members uh, will not attend at that moment. While uh, some guests, just listening, wives of uh, members or husbands, uh, are welcome to sit in our ranks and listen to us. And if you have something important in a discussion to say, you are also welcome to contribute. With these uh, few words, I think I like to ask uh, Marcelo Sanchez Orondo uh, to present his uh, short introduction. Nothing. I